I have your message for today. Okay, so this is from my deck of cards, Addiction Recovery with the Law of Attraction. Um, and today, the one that I picked for the collective, whoever's watching this, whoever's viewing this video, is the Balance card. Balance. At the bottom, it says Mind, Body, and Soul. And I'm going to go ahead and read you this content on the back real quick. Okay, so this is your message for today. It is vital to remain in balance when recovering from an addiction or even just trying to break a bad habit. So what are bad habits? I mean, bad habits are just can be anything like negative thinking or overeating, um, having that extra drink when you promised you were only going to have two, you know, just these are, these are bad habits. Okay. Um, too much or not enough of daily responsibilities will quickly throw us off balance, which makes us prone to relapsing. Picking this card signifies that you should take inventory to be sure that you are placing an equal amount of importance in each area of your life. So some of us like um, can be workaholics and think that's a good thing. And in, in our society, at least in the United States, we make it like we actually can make pe lift people up. Like, oh my gosh, you did so much work, way to go. You know, you're working so hard and that's amazing. But it's important to take time to relax, time to rest, time to, you know, chill out, go on a trip, take a vacation, you know? And sometimes we're just work, 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 work. Okay, so have you been working too hard lately? I should have read that first. Or maybe not doing enough work. So that's the opposite extreme, right? What about leisure time? Do you take time to relax and enjoy yourself? Are you getting enough sleep each night? It is common to focus on one aspect of life too much while ignoring others. If you're taking care of someone, this card is urging you to take care of yourself first. Caretakers, you guys, caretakers do not get enough recognition in my personal opinion. You know, I've been in that situation. Most of us have, well, you know, depending on your age, but um, it is so difficult to be a caretaker. And we're going to be better at taking care of other people when we first take care of ourselves, right? Put your, put the oxygen mask on yourself first. Or another saying is, you cannot pour from an empty cup. So um, make sure, you know, make sure you get enough sleep. Sleep is super important. Um, that is when we're actually healing. Okay, so you will be a better caretaker when you feed your body healthy food, meditate, and exercise each day. You really can't afford not to. And med when I say meditate, this can be just 10 minutes of quieting your mind. It doesn't have to be a big production, okay? Um, this card may also indicate that you may be overdoing the exercise and not eating enough nutritious foods. In other words, make sure you are not taking your weight loss efforts to the extreme, okay? Um, our bodies need nutrition. So, you know, not all foods are created equal. A thousand calories a day is not enough. Um, let's say you're having, you know, 1500 calories a day, but the calories aren't quality. That's not enough. You want to eat real food, nutritious food. Okay. Ask yourself which areas of your life may be out of balance and make a conscious effort to adjust your schedule so that you are giving an equal amount of time to your mind, body, and soul. Make sure to schedule time for fun, work, sleep, and relationships. Only you know what needs to shift in order for you to feel balanced and peaceful. When you are in balance, you will raise your energy level and be able to reach your goals even faster. So that's the balance card. And you guys, when it comes to nutrition, I want to say like there is not a lot of, it is difficult to eat healthy, especially in the United States. Like we don't eat, there's so much processed foods, fast foods, things like that. As much as you can. I'm not saying never. I'm not trying to tell you to be that extreme to where you never have fun or, or cheat, <laughs> cheat. So um, what you wanna do is try to avoid eating foods that come in a bag or a box, it's things that aren't fresh. Eat real whole foods, nutritious foods, okay? R red meat is the most nutrient dense food there is. For my vegans and vegetarians, um, just really make sure you're looking into really high quality protein. Um, plant-based stuff sometimes equals processed foods. Really pay attention to what kind of plant-based foods you are eating, okay? Make sure it's just not processed junk. Does it have a big long list of ingredients? 
That's not a good thing, okay? The less ingredients, the better. Okay, guys, well, I hope that helped. Let me know in the comments below if um, this resonated with you, and I hope you have a wonderful day.